Hi, my name is Tony and I always loved cycling. Some time ago, a friend of mine introduced me to e-biking. And since then, I never looked back. Today, I will be sharing with you some tips on how to discover e-biking for yourself. And I have a Škoda Kamek here that will help me get to some beautiful nature tracks. E-bike will give you all the benefits of cycling, but you're able to set the pace yourself. It is also much more effective if you want to lose weight because you can keep your heart rate in the ideal zone. There are a lot of choices while getting an e-bike, but today I'm just using a typical mid-range bike. But even that just makes a hard trip easier. It is quicker to start and gain speed again after a stop. Just remember a few simple rules. Take a break from time to time. And always wear your helmet. Always make yourself visible and loud if necessary. Install a solid bell. E-bikes can accelerate pretty quickly, so always watch your speed. Consider using backdoor rack, as e-bikes are usually heavier than regular bikes. If you do stow the bike on the roof rack, do not forget to take out the battery. Sometimes life ain't easy. I use the right tested app to find the best local tracks, profile information and latest weather forecast. Now it is time to hit the nature and show you that e-bike is very versatile and can be used in many environments. I always loved cycling in the mountains, but a few years ago it stopped feeling like fun. I was just too tired after the hard climbs. My knees started acting up. You get the idea. With an e-bike, I can enjoy the mountain views again. Watch your posture. An e-bike is heavier than a regular bike and has a different balance center. Use throttles sparingly and you can easily manage even long trips. Watch your battery charge levels, so you will not end up stuck somewhere at a remote place. Main thing is, you must have fun. Choose your trucks wisely, ride with friends, visit interesting places. I hope this helped to convince you give e-bike and cycling a chance, so see you on the road.